happening you two t train here we are back for more of our pokemon ultra moon nuzlocke and you guys it's been so long and i apologize but it's time for us to get on track um i do want to say real quick before i get going that i apologize for kind of going dark for the last couple the last couple of days uh it's just been really busy i've had you know it's it's holiday season thanksgiving was going on i've had a bunch of family things to do that you know all that notwithstanding um i probably i feel like i should have been more vocal about it on my twitter but i i don't know i just i kind of between the family stuff and just finally having like a day that i could just be gone for a little bit it was really nice uh it was kind of a needed necessary vacation so to speak i'm actually on my own vacation from work right now so i plan on putting in a bunch of work this week to uh to get the series rolling along a little bit better I might double upload this week, I don't know. Um, like I say, I'm going to be bulk recording quite a bit this week. So, I don't know. We'll see what happens with that. Um, we'll do a brief team update here right quick. Because I need it just as much as you guys probably do. Well, first up, we have Beatrice the Zubat with a wing attack, supersonic, astonish, and bite. I found the sharp beak, so I gave it to it. Because that's what makes the most sense to me. Next up, we have Yami, our Zorua, with Pursuit Fury, Swipes, Leer, and Fake Tears. Next, we have our starter, Cartman the Litten. Our little boy, our little boy, with Fire Fang, Lick, Scratch, and Work Up. After that, we have Static Shock the Grubbin, who's been the game, the, the MVP of the game so far. is really putting in good work. With Spark, Bite, Mud Slap, and Bug Bite. And last but not least, we actually... I'm, I'm going to add Cosmo to the team, at least for now. Um, I, I'll have to put in some work for it. But that's, that's you know, that's on me. Uh, we have Absorb, Fairy Wind, Stun Sport, and Struggle Bug. I just really don't have anything else better right now. And I could rock with the four, but why... I, I mean, I, I cry about these games not having more 7 gen mons readily available at the beginning of the game, and I have one here, and I could actually use it, so why would I not? <laughs> so that's, that's where we're going right now. So I, I told you guys at the end of the last episode, we'd probably hang out in the Seaward Cave for a minute so we can get an encounter here, and we're gonna get an encounter here, so our first encounter for Seaward Cave is going to be... A deli bird. That's that's interesting, huh? I got shady penguin staring me in the face right now, and I have to not kill it. Um, I'm gonna astonish you. Astonish probably won't do anything. Also, I think presence normal, so. Okay, I can probably do a little bit more to it than that. We do have a minus attack nature. We have a modest Zubat, which is which has to be like is it is is literally the worst thing you could ask for. But that's all right. That's okay. So we can put in the work right now to get this Deli Bird. I I mean, how do I not call it shady though? <laughs> how how honestly do I not call it shady? That's if I catch it, of course. Which I hope to do, for no other reason than to use it for dupes. But <laughs> I don't know how many areas in this game where you can catch a deli bird, but just throwing all these presents at me. Um, let me get off another astonish. Let me get off another astonish. That should put this thing in the red. Do you want to heal me? No, you don't. Okay. Nice, and in the red, just like I said what happened. Um, let's go ahead, switch out to Cartman. So we're taking less hits on Beatrice. Huh! I might have to grape all this thing just to make sure I catch it. Or... No, I think that's all I can do. That's the only thing I can really do to increase my chances, so we'll go ahead and throw a great ball at this thing, because I don't want to take any more hits, because that present is actually doing damage, and I'm not okay with it. We got three? 
All right, super duper. Super duper. So we have a deli bird. Like I said, I don't, I don't know. Oh, we got Cartman up to level 16. All right. Let's put in the work, guys. You want to learn double kick? I guess I could use that instead of lick. Oh, you know, I should have kept that for paralysis. Oh, well, too late for that. Too late for that. So my whole my whole thinking there was like, oh, well, if I keep Scratch, I can still use the Z-move. I have my experience share. Oh, no, 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 I don't. Beatrice was in the battle already. I know how to Pokemon, guys. <laughs> All right. So we got this adorable little deli bird here. We have this adorable little deli bird here. It wraps food in its tail to carry it around. The deli bird is the biggest tail is the... The deli bird with the biggest tail is the boss of the flock. Super duper. And I'm not calling you anything but shady. Oh, you're a female? Oops. You're the shady lady, I guess. <laughs> you're, the, you're the shady lady. That's cool, though. Uh, it's, it's a different mon. Yeah, I know. I appreciate the lookout. And don't be so sad. Come on, Rotom. Don't be so sad. We're BFFs. You're with me on this journey just as much as I'm with you. All right, let's try to get out of Mele Mele Meadow here. Actually, you know what I didn't do before was I skipped out on the uh, the, f the static flying encounters here. And I should probably do that. Um, if it's anything like the last game, it's probably just Firos. So, uh, not, not really anything great, but that, again, will allow me to dupes closet, so... What do you got coming my way? Baby, won't you come my way? It's a Spiro. Alright, that's fine. Like I said, if nothing else, that lets me use it as dupes later. Um, I can't really think of a time outside of Gen 1 that I've purposely used a Spiro. But hey, that's alright. That is alright. Not every Pokemon... It's not like you every Pokemon that you catch in every game that you play is something that you're going to use. It's just how it goes down. We got this thing nice and in the red. This thing might be holding a sharp peak itself. That's a decent chunk of damage. Also, Zubat's also really frail, so that probably has something to do with it. But let's go ahead, snag the Spiro. You go ahead and just stay in this ball and everything will be fan. Fantastic, super duper. Everything's going according to plan right now. I'm pretty happy about that. Um, and if you will remember, we did recently just beat the last, the first trial, I should say. So, uh, obviously with that being the only trial on this island that isn't a grand trial, that means all that stands in front of us is the grand trial, which I'm not sure if I'm going to get to today or not. Um, I kind of have it as a goal, but I'm not especially attached to it. We'll see what happens with the rest of the episode. Um, what do I want to call you? I don't know what to call you. Um, I'm just gonna call you... Oh, you're a female. Um, I'm gonna call you Lady... I'm doing here. I'll call you Lady Lana. That's that's gonna be your name because reason. You're a royalty. You are actual royalty. I don't. That, <laughs> I don't know what that was. I don't actually know what that was. But hey, Lady Lana, it's it's captured. It's ours. What do you have for me? A pretty wing. Oh boy. Super duper, you guys! I'm super stoked for Lady Lana here, who's gonna just sit in my PC and not really move around a whole lot. Um, but we will hit the Pokemon Center real quick, so we have taken some damage. And we can go ahead and drop off, uh, drop off Shady, the Shady Lady. I'm hoping I grabbed a stick. Oh, I gotta keep an eye out for stickers now! I, I all, I completely forgot! I need to watch out for stickers, because I want stickers. I want all the stickers. You got Lady Lana just chilling there. 
And you can just go ahead and say, oh, you have hustle. That's why you're hurting me so much. Wonderful. All right. So we'll do that. We'll get our heels up. And we'll get ready to go down Route 3. Thank you so much for all the things that you do for me, Nurse Joy. I love the things that you do. I love the way you love- I don't know what I'm going with there. That's terrible. <laughs> you should probably have an idea of what you're going to sing before you sing it so it doesn't just come out as whatever the hell that was. <laughs> that was just- that was just awfulness incarnate, like, at once. Oh, son of a biscuit-eating bulldog. Alright, yeah, I know, you're a Spiro. I'm, ha I'm super happy that you're a Spiro. Congratulations. How's that Spiro life treating you? Is it good? It's great, fantastic, wonderful, I'm proud of you. Alright, let's just go ahead and slide on out of here. And I can't get away. I, I just, I would really like to just get away so I wouldn't have to use- Don't call for help! I already don't want to fight you! I, do I already don't want to fight what's in front of me. I would just like to- Why?! Zubat's not slow! Thank you! It's not like Zubat is a slow Pokemon. Uh, that, oh, the dodges! The do oh, no, oh, no, no, oh, look at that! You just got wrecked, son! Are you a trainer? I'm gonna fight you, I want experience. I want experience. I don't, I'm not gonna waste my time fighting a Spearow that's not gonna give me experience. But I get to listen to this great music again. <laughs> I miss this music, you guys. I miss everything about this game. Like I, I like I said, I voluntarily took that time off because I needed it. What's this doing? You, you took one damage from me. That quad resisted Mega Drain. Oh, if you were adamant, that probably would kill. But whatever. You're gonna Mega Drain me again, that's fine. I am probably gonna have to heal up here in the very, very near future because Beatrice, I'm thinking, is probably gonna be my win condition for, uh, for Hala. So we can quad resist that stab. The hits are probably gonna hurt if it hits me with anything else, but that's something that we'll have to worry about when we get there. Uh, what was. Oh, that was. That was the meadow. Duh. Alright, moving on to Route 3. Is there a whole other area over here? Was there always another area over here? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah! Okay, cool, then, yeah, that was always there. Oh, you have the thing! Give me the thing! Yeah! Give me that Soothe Bell! I'm gonna need that when I get myself a Golbat. I am going to need that. I could actually probably... I'm not gonna put it on there now! Even though that literally was the thought that just came to my head. Okay, so, oh, you have Roost, okay. Didn't you have a red card last year? I feel like you had a red card last year. Um, let's just go ahead and run up in here. What's going on with you, man? Oh, you're a trial goer. I did my own island challenge once long ago. Hey, why don't you come here with me for a moment? Oh, stranger danger, stranger danger. Oh, look at that. I'm a little uncomfortable, I'm not gonna lie. When you see a rainbow like this, it's a good idea to pray that your journey will go well. It will bring you good fortune. Okay. This isn't the typical sort of rainbow like the ones you see when the raid lifts, but I think it'll still be effective. I'll be sure to offer up a prayer on this rainbow for your success on the island challenge. Thanks, dog. I appreciate it. Oh, that's a, that's a neat little, uh little add-on to the game there. I'm not sure how necessary it was, but it's, it's cool. Not every not every uh, NPC is going to be like the most useful person in the world. I'll draw the power of my partner, Growlithe, by giving an item a hold. Okay. Super duper. Wait, are you going to add the red card then? Mm. Alright, so you, have, you actually have a Growlithe coming at me, that's fine. That's okay! Um... 
don't really have a switch out, honestly. Let's see how much damage this thing's doing to me. I got, I mean, I got a couple levels on it. Actually, let's, let's go ahead and hit a supersonic. That wasn't nothing! Was that like 10 points? It was either 10 points or 12 points, I don't know what. Admittedly, I only paid so much attention, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie about that. Let's go ahead and get a heal up on Beatrice. Let's see if this thing wants to smack itself. You don't want to smack yourself. Okay, so that is 13 damage. We are not staying in here for that. Uh, Cartman, you're kind of my only switch here. You're kind of my only switch here. Nobody else is really doing anything to this thing either. And you're not gonna hit yourself, that's fine, that's good. Hello- oh, it's a crit, okay. That makes a little more sense, um... Let's see what we can do with a double kick. Let's try to work out our double kick. That's okay. Go ahead and hit yourself, Growlithe. Am I, like, destined to have RNG fail me? This is like... <laughs> this is like actually the, the trial all over again. If you hit yourself, you can just be gone. Yeah! Alright! Something worked out in my favor. I'm also really mad at myself about that island trial. Um, I didn't- I haven't addressed it since that episode was recorded. Like, I don't think I- I think I've even recorded an episode since then and I didn't, uh, I didn't address it. But I actually went out of my way to lower the thing's special defense and then I started hitting it with Magnet Bomb, which did nothing. Because Magnet Bomb is indeed a physical attack and in my head it was special. So obviously it didn't go my way. And I was just sitting there for an entire episode going, WHY ISN'T THIS WORKING?! And it's because you could you do a stupid thing, stupid things come of it. Honestly, it's what comes out. I don't- I don't know that I would've been able to save my Magnemite anyway, because there was a lot of heal stalling going on, and I never really got a, a real opportunity aside from the one attack that I did get off with it. But, it's whatever. In the past, nothing we can really do about it, meow. Are you a trainer? Hello, you're a local, aren't you? I've got a favor to ask someone like you. Please, you gotta help me. Hey! Right. Thanks, kid! That's the Alola spirit! You're so nice here. I'm actually here on my honey. My beautiful bride has completely fallen for this Pokemon they call Sableye. I've heard that Sableye can get along with Carbink, which lives at 10 Carat Hill. Could you catch a Sableye for me at 10 Carat Hill? If you do... Okay, so you want the next information for it. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Um... I mean, even if it's not my first encounter, I might just snag one just to do that, but obviously I wouldn't be using it at that point. Oh, okay, we're just- we're just down at Route 1 already. Was that- Was there only, like, one trainer here? What? Was there really only, like, one trainer on this route? Why well, body bag that bitch? I mean, I guess there are the other two over there. Alright. Let's do it! Let's do it! I don't know that I'll ever actually use Roost, but I mean, the experience isn't a terrible thing. So, why would I turn that down? Oh, you have a Slowpoke coming out! That actually kind of works in my favor. So we have Beatrice out front, and we can just... We can bite the crap out of this thing. You're on par with me, which isn't great, but that's okay. Oh my god, that did nothing! That did nothing! Um, I don't wanna... I don't wanna close my eyes. I don't wanna fall asleep. I miss you, babe, and I don't wanna miss a thing. I mean, I have all of the super effective moves on Static Shock. <laughs> Let's go to Static Shock. So honestly, the, the faster I can get Static Shock leveled up, the better. I want that Charger Bug as soon as I can get it. Okay, okay, okay. 
Um, let me check the difference between Spark and Bug Bite. We got 65 to 60. But we have the the item for Bug Type. Let's go, let's go Bug Bite. Let's see what we can do with a Bug Bite. Pretty sizable, pretty sizable. You're gonna yawn me. I might just stay in and take this one. I'll, I'll take this yawn, because I can switch out to somebody else. Let's go ahead and Bug Bite. I actually have Awakening, too. You're withdrawing! To whom? To Butterfree. Well, joke's on me, I guess. And I'm sleep. You're lucky I didn't switch it up and go for Spark, man. I would have annihilated your Butterfree. So the Blaze Cartman. Blaze Cartman. So I'm not trying to switch my Zubat in on a confusion. The Silver Wind shouldn't be doing a whole heck of Oh my god! What? That's not even a crit? Hold the phone! On what planet? What? And you're getting all the boosts. What is happening right now? I don't understand what's happening. I'm about to hit a wing attack. You outspeed me! Woo! We lived it! And we did nothing! Okay, but we lived it! I can't live too, though. And now you're roosting. Okay, but how much are you getting back? Are you going back to full? You're not going back to full. Okay. I'm gonna supersonic you. This is a bad sign if I have to dance around a Butterfree. But if you wanna go ahead and hit yourself a couple times, that would be super duper. And kind of necessary. <laughs> and kind of necessary. TBH, TBH. Go ahead and hit yourself. Yeah! Alright! Now we can get another wing attack off. You're gonna withdraw the Butterfree, you're gonna bring out your Slowpoke again, that's fine. Probably won't kill with the wing attack, yeah I didn't expect to, but we can take it out with a bite. And we outspeed, so we're good there, super duper! We hit level 15, so we should be taking those hits a little bit better. Especially now because it had two Silver Wind boosts, because RNG hates me. <laughs> um, we'll stay in. So we should be taking that hit a little bit better now. And let's Supersonic again. You're gonna roost up to full, that's fine. That's kind of a wasted turn, honestly. Catch the supersonic. And let's start getting some wing attacks going. Let's start getting some wing attacks going. Yeah, man. That was a good move. That was the, the best move you could have. Look at that damage. Now we're out here. Now we're actually out here. Super. All right, Beatrice. Beatrice is actually carrying her weight! I'm proud of her! She sounds, with a name like Beatrice, she sounds like a big girl, but she's carrying her weight here, and I'm proud of her. We got Static Shock up to 17, Cartman grow up to level 17. To think, you've wounded my pride, which is harder than diamonds. Lit. <laughs> oh, yeah! I don't know what that voice crack was, but I'm so happy right now! Bro, look at that animation! That's so good! 
That's so useful too! Oh, that's so good. That's so good. Our boy, our little boy evolved! I'm so happy! When its mane is standing on end, you can tell it's feeling good. When it's fe when it isn't feeling well, its fur will lie fl down flat. Lit. Right on. No new moves, but that's okay. That's okay. That is quite all right. It was a fine battle. My heart feels as light and clear as the blue sky that appears after a storm passes through. This is proof of the battle between your team and my own. Take it, my, f my strong friend. Cool, 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 cool. No doubt, no doubt, no doubt. You will likely find other trainers like me on the routes of Alola searching for strength. Challenging them with your Pokemon would not be a bad reason to take a journey. You're right. Rotom, stop being sad! Crikey. <laughs> Alright. We gonna run on down here now. Hit Route 1 back. Oh, give me the item though. Trying to hide that Super Potion for me out in plain sight? You knew I wouldn't find it if it was out in plain sight. Well, the joke is on you because it's mine now. And I already went over there for an item. Super cool, fun times 3,000. Oh, look at the rock rough! I'm not gonna wake it up. I'm not gonna wake it up. Oh, you know what? That's the trial. I don't want to go to the trial just yet. I want to head home first. I want to go home. And uh, get my heels up. I don't know why that awkward pause was there. Actually, I guess I can just go to the Pokemon Center now, to be honest. If I'm just being honest. All right, cool, cool, cool. Let me in here. Let me on in here. We can go ahead and get our heels up. Look at that Tora cat right in the middle. I'm so happy. I'm so happy, my little boy. My little boy's growing up so fast! And we also really need some super potions. Uh, 10 will do. I'm cool with 10. We're a little, little short on the money side, but that's okay. Because we're doing what we have to do right now. We're doing exactly what we have to do right now, so let's go ahead. We're gonna go ahead, I'm, I'm, it's gonna be a longer episode, but they all kinda have been so far. You kinda have to do that in these games. Is this a new encounter area? Oh, I'd come back for it, okay. Well, I'll come back for it later. We kinda, like, you kinda have to play for this long a period of time in these games anymore, just to actually accomplish anything, to be honest. Um, real quick. I do have two Rotom boosts if I need them. Um, I'm gonna give Cartman Normalium Z. We have Scratch, so that makes sense. What normal move do I have on Beatrice? Oh, Supersonic, I guess? I wonder what Z Supersonic does. I have no idea. Oh well. But we do have Kahuna Hala up here, and hopefully he doesn't insert fist into rectum. I'm looking forward to seeing what moves you and your Pokemon will pour your soul into. Now that you've gone and cleared your first trial, T-Train. That's true! I'm not a trainer, so I'm sure I don't really understand how hard it must have been. But even I think it's a great achievement. Nebby is a fan, too. The Melamela Kahuna is strong, cousin. He's a trainer who can use fighting type Pokemon to the fullest, yeah? Might not be a bad idea to work on those flying or psychic type moves. I mean, I have. <laughs> I'm doing what I can. I'm doing what I can! Alright. We're all healed up. We've got, we've got decent levels, TBH. Um, I guess we just run up in there. I guess we just run up in there. Oh, well, congratulations on clearing your trial in the Verdant Cavern. Good work. I suppose you are here to battle the Kahuna. You think you and your Zubat are ready for me, T-Train? Nope. But I'm gonna. <laughs> I've been waiting for this. Yeah, if this goes down anything like anything else has so far, this is probably not gonna go cleanly. I'm probably gonna sit here crying the whole time. 
But I'm gonna do what I can. I've been expecting you. Allow me to properly greet the young adventurers embarking on the island challenge. I am the I am Hala, the Kahuna of Mela Mela Island. Shall we begin? The final tri trial here on Mela Mela Island will be a Pokemon battle against me, the Kahuna. It is known as the Grand Trial. Well, T Train, you've been entrusted with the Sparkling Stone by Tabu Koko. Now show me you and your partner Zubat and your team's full power. Old Hala will also be going all out. Let the trial begin! Yo, what if he used the Pokemon that he used, like, at the end of the last game? <laughs> That'd be fucked up. That would be fucked up. That would be him actually going all out. That would be fucked up. We're gonna start out with a Machop here. And I don't really have any setup moves, so I'm just gonna go straight up for the Supersonic. We're gonna land it, which is good news. That's good. Good, 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 good news. I'm super thrilled about that. You just wanna go ahead, punch yourself right in the face. You don't. You wanna revenge me. Ugh, okay. That still hits harder than I want it to. And I haven't even touched you yet. You have a full heal, this cheeky bastard. Alright, let's go ahead, Supersonic again, since you want to be a little bitch. And we missed that one! Cool, 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 cool. No doubt, no doubt, no doubt. We hit this one, though, so that's all that really matters. I would have liked to have Supersonic them last time without taking damage, but beggars cannot be choosers. Okay, and that's still not doing a whole lot of damage, so we're in okay shape so far. Okay, we got this thing in the red. It's probably gonna heal up. So that does noticeably more damage. Since he's gonna heal up, I mean, I kinda need to either way, so. We'll go ahead and do that. I don't know that I wanna use my Rotom power ups yet. If I can avoid using them during the trial, like, I would I would like to have them readily available for me next trial. So I'm gonna try to avoid using that. And let's go right back for another wing attack. And you snapped out of confusion! Without getting confused! Good for you! If that's not, like, the definition of how my, my time in this game has been going so far, I don't know what is. We're missing Supersonic some more! That's good, that's good. The RNG is totally in my favor today. Everything is going great, everything is fantastic. We're missing more Supersonics, cool, cool, cool. Um, I missed more Supersonics and then you've actually, you know, hit yourself because you haven't hit yourself at all. But that's, you know, that's, that's, um, that's a thing. That's a thing, that's how life is going. <laughs> it's just, I'm not, I'm not mad. I'm not mad at all, uh, promise. I'm, I might be lying, but that's okay. I guess you use the focus energy and I'm not being critted either, so that, I guess, also kind of factors in. Like, that That kind of is working itself out a little bit. So if you just want to go ahead and hit yourself. Thank you! Finally! Alright, let's swing attack. Swing attack will probably not knock this thing out. Or we will! Cool! Even better! Even better! Beatrice, you're doing well for us. You're doing well for us. You got Makuita coming in. Just kind of gonna suck because you're gonna be nice and bulky, but that's okay. Uh, we're gonna go for the Supersonic again. You're gonna fake me out. That's what you're supposed to do. If you have it, you use it. I do have inner focus, so it didn't actually affect me. You're you're gonna dodge. That's good for you. Yeah, these arm thrusts aren't going to do anything to me. That nice, nice quad resist that we have on our Zubat right now. Um, I am going to heal up because I don't know if you're just softening me up for something worse. You gotta have at least tackle or something. I might just go for the wing attack. I might just be done going for supersonics against this thing. I might just be done going for Super Sonic. Let's just swing attack and see what we're doing. Let's just swing attack and see what we're doing. Okay, so that's over half. S 
see how many arm thrusts we take. We're only missing seven damage. I'm gonna go ahead and just wing attack again. I kind of want to be at full strength when this uh, when this crab brawler comes in. I'm assuming he has a crab brawler. He had a crab brawler in the last game. We are gonna catch a level up. Yeah, you do still have the crab brawler. That's good for you. This thing I'll probably try to supersonic. I know this thing's probably gonna try to Z move on me. You have Pursuit, okay. That's not minimal damage. I'm gonna try to heal up here though because I feel like you're probably gonna try to Z move me. I feel like you're probably gonna try to Z move me right now. Now if you just wanna hit yourself, that'd be great. Go ahead and just hit yourself. Just go ahead and hit yourself. Okay. Oh, you're leering. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. That's not good. That's not good. Let's get a wing attack on this thing. Go ahead and hit yourself. We speed tie? Nice! Nice! Perfect! Perfect! Ugh, still not a lot of damage, though. That's still not a lot of damage. How much is this pursuit doing now? That's not good. <laughs> I just don't know if he's gonna heal up. At this point, he might be trying to Z-move me. I'm just, I'm really weary of that Z-move coming my way. I'm really weary of it, especially now that I have a Leer on me. Like, I realize I still quad resist it. But I can take him out with one wing attack. One wing attack will kill. Perfect, perfect. That's exactly what we need. Okay, so we got there with a little bit of luck, but we got there. We got there. We're out here, boys. We have our trial done with, taken care of. Mela Mela Island is almost done. I'm going to run around and get some encounters. But other than that, whoo! I was really worried about that. He didn't try to Z-move at all, unless he tried to do it when I was when he was confused. But he didn't, he didn't try to Z-move at all. Hmm. The results come as no surprise to me. What a fine trainer. And what a fine Pokemon, too. Zubat really did it all by itself. Beatrice came out, put in the work, and she just she just showed out. Oh, and our mighty Tapu Koko agrees. Hmm. Perhaps Tapu Koko is hoping that a day may come when you will grow strong enough to battle it as well. Except the Z-Crystal. It allows trainers to share their power with their partner Pokemon. Lit. Any grand trial is nerve-wracking, even though we actually were in really good shape for that trial with Beatrice. Still nerve-wracking, but it, that, I mean, that was about as well as that could turn out. Yo, we did the thing, we did the thing, we did the thing, we did the thing, we did the thing! Observe, T-Train. If you wish to use Fighting-type Z power, Move your arms like this and bend your hips like this pose. I should actually bust out my Z-Ring one of these episodes. I totally have one. Now then, T-Train, with this victory, you've cleared all of the trials of Melamela Island, the first of Alola's islands. The Melamela stamp is proof of your accomplishments. With it, Pokemon up to level 35, even those you've received in trade, will obey you. The moon in the daytime. The sun at night. Now to see if you can pour your heart into something that cannot be seen, but is very much real. As you continue your island challenge, consider what makes up the people and Pokemon that you meet. Both what you can see and what you cannot. You will surely meet Tapu Koko again someday. That sounds like a threat, and I'm not okay with it. <laughs> that sounds like a fucking threat. Muar. More Muar. Whoa there, Tauros! I've got an idea. How about I set you up with set you up so you can ride my Tauros whenever you'd like. No reason why he shouldn't get to enjoy the island challenge too. Lit. I am absolutely about that life. I'll take care of all the little things you'll need in order to ride a Pokemon T train. <laughs> that handoff is always just so good. It's so delayed. Why don't you hop on there? Let me up! 
Beat me up, Scotty. Let me go. Yo. <laughs> Look at Macho Man House Savage back there. The world looks a, diff a bit different from a top of Mighty Tauros, eh? CT Train! Here in Alola, our Pokemon lend us their sh Oh, fuck, that's Hala. I was how? I, I don't fucking- I don't fucking know what's going on. Here in Alola, our Pokemon lend us their strength and let us ride them about. Let me explain some of the gear I gave you. Your ride pagers- I mean, we already know how this works. I've- I've played a game awfully similar to this one before. I do like the new ride gear, though. Yo, I like that purple on the new ride gear. That looks really cool. I really like that. Not like the one in the last game was bad, but I, I like this one more, actually. Oh, congratulations, T-Train! Your performance has been a delight ever since I first laid eyes on you at the trainer's school. I don't know why I went Pegasus there for a second. Woo, Kaiba boy! I'm amazed that you won without even using your sea power! Oh, I know! Why not stop by the Alola Photo Club for a commemorative photo? With Tauros, you can be down to Holy, Holy City in no time at all! Very well then, off on your island challenge you go! May the future bring you happiness! Can y'all shut up now? <laughs> With a little help from Tauros, T-Train, you'll be able to smash right through those big rocks on Route 1. Tell me about it. <laughs> Alright, I got a little something for you too! Oh, false wipe! Oh, cool. I'm about that life. False Swipe is move that will leave your opponent with 1 HP when you attack. Keep on catching more and more Pokemon, yeah? And let Rotom learn all about them. But first, you gotta let your mom know what you're up to. When you're done with that, head on down to the marina in Holy City, oh yeah! Ooh, and if you're heading to Holy, you should totally check out the shopping mall! And the Alola Photo Club, too! What well, are man? <laughs> Guys, I just wanna be done. You know, the one Illama mentioned, he totally had the right idea, dude. You should go to the Alola Photo Club and take a special photo to remember clearing your first grand trial. Good thinking, Hal. And once you finish your grand trial, you'll be able, you'll be doing the same thing, yeah? <laughs> I sure hope so, but first, dude. Come on, dude, dude. Don't go easy on me now. All right. Can we all- can we be done with all the exposition now? Like, I already finished the trial, it was just... You're all getting so strong already, yeah? Huh? I can't wait to see how much more you'll grow! Alright, time to get the boat ready! Lily, are you gonna help me clean it? <laughs> Nebby is not. Nebby said, fuck a lot of that noise. Alright guys, well that's- we're gonna wrap up today's episode, but we have our first grand trial down and taken care of. Um, and the next episode will probably be just, uh, finishing up some things on Mela Mela Island before we head off to Akala. But that's gonna end today's episode, so just a reminder, if you do like what you see here today, we want to see more of it, make sure you smack the like button down below, because if you don't know, your support is very much appreciated, and now you know. But with that, I'm getting out of here, so you guys enjoy the rest of your day, and with everything you do, always remember to stay on track. Bye!